And what's your, uh, what was like the biggest lesson you got to take away from these three preseason games and get, getting a lot of playing time? Yeah, you know, I thought every every opportunity you get to go get reps and, and go learn and, and see different defenses and different speeds and different things up front, I think it's a really good opportunity opportunity for me to grow and, and make the mistakes that, you know, I need to make to learn. And obviously tonight didn't go our way and I made some decisions that I wish I had back, but that's part of this game. And I'm a rookie and I got to learn and I got to go with the ups and the downs and you know, take what's there, but I'm glad that you know, I had a really good group up in front that was fighting for me all night, and the guys outside, on, you know, AT to Lucas to John Trey, they all, all did their part to try to help me tonight, and you know, it just didn't go our way. What do you think about Lucas's game? I mean, obviously, people got to see it a little bit tonight, but you know, we've seen a little bit of that all throughout camp. Yeah, no, I think Lucas does a really good job. Uh, he's been battling a little bit of uh, aches and pains here and there, and he always comes out and has given me his best effort. And, you know, I appreciate the work he's put in this camp and the work that we put in together this this off season. And you know, the crazy part is I've never been through you know around a cusp before. But some guys may may be here and some may not be here. So just got to grow with the guys that you're around and, and appreciate the relationships you build along the way and keep learning from it. What areas do you feel like you still need to grow in? Um, you think about it. I've been in this offense for 20 practices, 25 practices, and um, you know, I felt like I had a really productive camp. I felt like I did a lot of really good things and. Obviously tonight with a little learning lesson to, to grow from and, and improve on, and you know I, I'm not going to let you know one bad game um, affect how I feel about being in the city and, and affect how my training camp's going. I've done a really good job uh, protecting the football and, and putting guys in positions to make plays, and tonight just didn't work out for us. So go watch the tape, get better, and improve, and that's all you can do. How was that Gatorade? Uh, yeah, got, got me a little bit. I got a couple couple uh, elbows now, so yeah. I thought I was gonna get a flag, but I obviously didn't. So um, just trying to do my best, get the ball ball down the field, and try to get some points for our team. Are you glad you were able to at least flash the wheels there for a bit? I felt like I needed to unhitch the trailer a little bit. Um, you know, it, it caught me by surprise. The middle kind of voided and made a guy miss, and um, ended up making a play. So it was good. I don't know if you look forward at all, but have you talked to anyone about just kind of like what role you might have in the season? Because I know when they have three quarterbacks, sometimes the, the third guy doesn't get a ton of reps in practice. Yeah. I'm just going day by day. Yeah. Um, you know, I think I've shown them that I can be productive and, and do a lot of really good things, and I don't think they expect things to just happen overnight for a rookie. Um, I think you got to go in, you got to learn, you got to go, like I said, through the ups and the downs, and I think I've had a lot more good than I've had bad this camp. You guys have seen it. You guys have been there every single practice. And um, I think there's a lot to learn from, a lot to grow from, but there's a good foundation where we're starting. So just keep getting better. Is it tough to like, know it's going to be a while before you get another chance after putting, it, <laughs> putting together something like this? Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's tough. Um, you know, I'm a competitor, and every chance yeah. I get, I want to be on the field making plays. And, and the crazy thing in this league is you never know when your opportunity is going to come. And you know, I'm going to prep like I'm the starter every single week and do everything I can to learn from guys like Jameis and Derek. And, if there's at some point, any point during the season that I have an opportunity to go play and do something, I'm going to be ready and I'm going to put the put the preparation in to, to give myself the best opportunity to go play well. I know we've asked you this before, but you know, not having those 20, 25 practices with Eric, just kind of being in the same room with him, the pre-existing relationship, how beneficial do you think that it's been just kind of to you as far as learning? Yeah, I think it's been great. And, and continuing to build on the relationship that we kind of had, I wouldn't say it was like a... And I know you really well. I think you know coming into work every single day, just kind of understanding the type of guy he is has been great for me. Um, just his approach to the game, everything he does, the, the the family man he is. I just think he's a really good person for me to model my game after and try to model you know everything outside of this 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 game after. So I'm appreciative of him and everything he's helped me with through this camp. And you know he came up to me tonight and said you know there's a lot of really good things you did this camp. Don't let one opportunity or one Derail you from from what you've done so far. So I appreciate them, and we'll continue to grow together. Thanks, Jake. Thanks.